New at 10, for more than four decades, they've been bringing the best of Broadway to San Diego audiences. And when they went dark in February of 2020 due to the pandemic, no one thought this intermission would last this long. But yesterday, after pushing their season back twice, Broadway San Diego announced their long-awaited return to the stage with a trio of shows in the fall, including Hairspray and My Fair Lady. I spoke with the general manager about the November shows coming to the Balboa and Civic Theaters and what it means to those who have been out of work and the arts community at large. I've often heard people say, you know, arts isn't uh, what you do, it's who you are. And I know there's a lot of people in this industry, no one could expect this. Industry giants couldn't plan for this. And there are a lot of people who just want to come back to doing what they love. And so what this signals is that for a long time, we just weren't sure how high this was gonna go. Where was the peak? Now we know where it was and The whole time there was just hope and now we're ready. We're ready to see it all realized again. There's nothing like an arts audience in San Diego. And I know that we don't, we're not alone in feeling that way. We have some incredible arts organizations here in San Diego that would just echo that thought. Um, but I also know that a lot of audience members will come and they'll see these magnificent cast members or performers on the stage right under that spotlight and maybe not realize until this closure there are hundreds of people who made that moment possible, right? Anything from the person who's dressing that actor to the truck driver that drove the stage set to the person who helped build that stage set, the poster work, the ticket work. I mean, there were a lot of people suddenly who were without jobs. And so when we get back into the theater and we know that, that all these people are coming back to doing what they love, there's... It's just, it's breathtaking. So what is your slate of shows that you have ready to debut in November? Yeah. So the exciting part is we were able to announce our season uh, at the beginning of the year, 2020, before all business was interrupted. And so we're probably one of the few markets, I think, that was able to keep their core season intact. So we're excited about that. So we'll be starting in November. Uh, we do have Elton Brown Live start uh, for one night at the Balboa Theater and the national tour of Hairspray will perform for eight nights, uh, November 15th, starting November 16th, excuse me, it's a Tuesday night. Uh, so they start loading in on the 16th and I'm ready. So one of the things about Hairspray is it's a San Diego favorite. It's an exciting way to return because it just, it's one of the things that it's going to do is, is um, it's something that you're familiar with. So it'll feel good to see it again. And if you haven't had a chance to see it or if you're a young audience member, Joining us for the first time, it's one of those shows that uh, um, makes it easy to, to become an audience member, right? It's, um, My Fair Lady follows that in November 30th. There's a couple of twists on the old classics, but on the old classic story, but it's, um, it's another one of those shows that when you are thinking of theater and you want to return to something familiar, that's just what's going to happen. We kick it off next year in the spring with, with uh, the band's visit, which, you know, is a Tony Award winner. And there's a lot of exciting titles behind that, including Hades Town and Pretty Woman and Tootsie and all these new shows that um, haven't been here before. And because touring companies need time to rehearse, ramp up, and travel between cities, the shows, again, don't debut until the fall. But the best way to find out about tickets to shows or if you are a season ticket holder and need assistance is to sign up for e-alerts at broadwaysd.com. It's also too early to know exactly what kind of safety protocols will be in place by then, but they will alert ticket buyers of those as well. For a link, just go to our website. That's fox5sandiego.com and click the Scene On tab.